Hello and welcome to Musing with Tanya D. I am your host, spiritual life coach, holistic shaman medium, and subtle energy surgeon Tanya D. And how is everybody feeling at this time and space? It kind of feels like we need some time with faith, and it needs an upgrade from fear, and fear needs the downgrade. So I recently did a live show for one of my LinkedIn friends, sharing a little Tanya time just about myself. And I planned or I set a date for a little Tanya time after the peak of the chaos of this Corona virus as well. But I just wanted to muse about a few things here. Wi-Fi and electromagnetic currents. So I'd recommend that you turn your Wi-Fi off actually before you go to bed. Matter of fact, I would only turn it on when you need it. So trying to make that a minimum amount of time each and every day. Why? Because we are highly aware that our environment is increasingly saturated with man-made electromagnetic waves of frequency. So these are called EMFs. And these EMFs can be aggressive to our human being or our human body. Of course, our gesture is only making a small, small, minute difference with so many other dangerous radiations, like our TVs, cell phones, even cell towers, and other electrical devices in our homes that are all plugged in, places we work, stores, actually you name it, because they are there, they are everywhere. Small appliances, basically anything that's plugged in can generate these electromagnetic fields. And all of these are in addition to other natural sources of high frequency vibrations that are influencing our Earth, the galaxy and the Earth or the cosmic energies. So where the sun is the most significant, so imagine for just a second how you would feel when you read the most recent trend report that there are wellness summers or resort centers along with upscale housing developers who are now creating programs within the construction to just allow the Wi-Fi to be turned off when you actually turn your lights off. What an amazing idea, right? So we as humans experience, we've had eons of time to address these cosmic and earthly energies of influencers. But at the same time, we're literally bombarded with man-made electromagnetic frequencies that are multiplying at a rate in minute amounts of time. But brace yourself and bring on the onslaught of 5G. The cell phone infrastructure that will and has actually created a new level of electromagnetic aggression to both our environment and our bodies. Why is this an issue? Because we know from wisdom of ancient energy medicines that the human body is more than just simple matter, solids and fluids. It's a critical element of vital energy as well. So it's vital energy that matter is vital. What does that mean? So we know this to be real because it's been proven by modern science. Richard Gruber actually in Vibrational Medicine in a handbook that, um, that the physical body has this complex network of interwoven energetic fields. And being a being of energy, we follow that we can be affected by energy. Meaning that the human body could be affected negatively by certain energies and even positively by others. So this is where vibrational medicine in time and space of coincidence to increasing the danger from these EMFs multiplying in our modern living times. Stemming from our blind addiction to high tech devices, myself included. So turning off the Wi-Fi at night will continue to be kind of insufficient except as a reminder that we're living in a modern world of electromagnetic pollution. We are literally every day under persistent attack. Like some homes even have a panic room. 
or uh, a more significant solution to this EMF bombardment will require spaces that are free of EMFs that offer opportunities to actually temporarily or even occasionally experience one of these EMF detoxes. So what does this mean? In the meantime, we are going to have to take advantage of any and all small opportunities to avoid unnecessary exposure and even at the means of our disposal to improve this vital energy balance. So you can find other information about the dangers of EMFs on my site, YouTube, just different ways to shield against the bombardment in the best way that you possibly can. But the following points that I really want to stress are that EMFs are increasingly rapidly anticipating a huge worsening with the materialization of these 5G towers, including all the cell phone services. And the need to have a bedroom with limited EMFs is, if any, in your bedroom. Your sleep quality and quantity, which is essential for proper rest, along with creating rejuvenation, it's affected by these EMFs. So an amazing way to, or a method to detox from these EMFs, one way is steam saunas, which are free from nearby EMFs. But um, these are just some suggestions. For me, it's to go nurture in nature. Sit by a river, go hug a tree, go on a hike, go be out in nature. And let the mother of the earth nourish you for a change. So thanks for joining me. These are just some shifting times that we're in. If you haven't followed me on any social media platforms, you can find me at What's Up Tanya D on Facebook. On Instagram, I'm at the Tanya D. On Twitter, I'm at Green Skinny Girl. On YouTube, I am Tanya D, and that's probably where you are. But if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do and go ahead and ring the bell. On iTunes or Apple, subscribe to my podcast, Musing with Tanya D. And I really highly recommend season two at the current moment. It's all about the elements. It's a view from an energetic perspective, and it's nature within the elements, which I feel we need to go back and connect to. Season three was all the energy world, and this year I've coined it the subtle energy season, and ironically, I'm talking about energetic boundaries for the first few episodes. I should say at least the first 10. But you can also find me on Spotify, Visit my corridor for well-being and well-healing at club.tanyadee.tv where I host all my online courses, um, The Balance of Being, Soliciting Solitude, and just released um, The Energy Body Demystified. So go ahead and check that out. And you can find me at tanyadee.tv where I host everything all from if you're ready to transform to eating healthier, having more vitality, essential oils to shift your frequency, and so much more. You can find all of the links in the show notes below. And until next time, Ashe. Blessings, my friends. Mm -hmm.